Here's some live Ben Folds for you. On Friday, October 4th. 10.03 a.m. This is DJ Doc V. You're listening to Office Hours with DJ Doc V. Uh, good morning. Um, it is uh, Friday, and it is College Radio Day. Boy, we're all excited here. Uh, we're broadcasting from the Brownsville campus today, um, and we're set up here to uh, meet the, the folks on the Brownsville campus uh, at, with College Radio Day. We've got, uh, we've got our music set up outside the Union if you're uh, here on campus today, make sure you uh, listen. Uh, come on down and visit us here. Uh, we've got some snacks to give away, some water. Um, and we'll show you how to download the Radio Garden app. Hopefully you're listening to us on uh, our Radio Garden. If you're listening on the web browser now, great, uh, super. But there's a great app called Radio Garden. It's free. It's available for both uh, iPhone and Android devices. And uh, you go to your app, it, 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 it's got some pop-up ads, but, you know, um, make sure you download it, uh, search for Vaquero Radio, make sure you favorite us, and then uh, you can listen to us 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year. Um, we got some great uh, music picked out for you for this hour. Um, up at, at 11 o'clock is when we go live here uh, on the Brownsville campus with the College Radio Day. So uh, yesterday's event we did in Edinburgh, it was a great success, got to interact with a lot of students, um, the, uh, uh, the uh, nonpartisan uh, interest group of Battleground, Battleground Texas was uh, registering folks to vote, they'll be out today also registering folks to vote. Remember it is the last weekend you could register to vote here in Texas if you want to vote on November 5th here in Texas in the presidential, in the general election. Uh, remember, it's not just president on the ballot. There's other folks up and down the ballot. Make sure you uh, uh, vote for all of our um, folks that are running for office. And um, if you're not registered, you've got uh, today uh, and then Monday, the 7th is the deadline. So if uh, and remember, we don't have online voter registration in Texas yet. So make sure that you bring your voter registration form down to the county electoral office uh, in um uh, I'm not sure where it is in Cameron County, but uh, in Hidalgo County, it's right in Edinburgh uh, and on Cosner Boulevard, uh, not too far from campus. So, um, Or you could come down to College Radio Day today if you live in Cameron County. Uh, they'll be registering people to vote, uh, and the v deputy voter registrar will do it all for you. So uh, uh, come down to the campus today and register to vote, pick up some snacks, meet our staff. That'll be spinning tunes starting at about 11 o'clock this morning. So... Uh, let's get back to the music right now. We've got uh, a little Led Zeppelin coming up here. This one's called Celebration Day from Led Zeppelin 3. Uh, not necessarily a deep cut, but Led Zeppelin 3, not the most famous of all the Led Zeppelin records. Let's check this one out only on Vaquero Radio, the Valley's student station. And we started off that set with a little Led Zeppelin from the Led Zeppelin 3 album with Celebration Day. Uh, that's, I don't know if we played that one on uh, Office Hours before. Good morning, Vaqueros. This is DJ Doc V. It is uh, 16 minutes after the hour. You're listening to Office Hours uh, as we gear up for College Radio Day. Uh, we're already playing tunes at the uh, Brownsville Student Union Lawn. Uh, you can check us out. Uh, come on down and say hi to our staff that are spinning tunes. Uh, we'll be out there till 3 o'clock this afternoon. So make sure you come by and, uh, and uh, visit with us. Um, We've got uh, a chance for you to uh, get a Vaquero Radio t-shirt. So uh, everybody loves a free t-shirt, don't you? It's uh, 81 degrees right now. Uh, we're looking for a high of 85 here out in Brownsville. Slight chance of rain, 15% chance of rain. Um, but it looks like it's going to be a high of 86. Uh, and the weekend looks pretty good, although it might be some rain. A uh, high of 83 tomorrow with a pretty significant chance of rain and thunderstorms. Sunday, 87 with a 56% chance of rain. Monday, sunny skies and 89. And Tuesday, sunny skies and 90 degrees as a high uh, in uh, uh, Lower Valley here in Brownsville. Uh, I've got a great poem picked out for you at 50 minutes after the hour. It's, uh, it's one uh, from one of my favorite artists, Leonard Cohen. Uh, and it's one that he uh, did in a, a recitation uh, during one of his shows called A Thousand Kisses Deep. We'll do that one at 50 minutes after the hour. And also at the bottom of the hour, we've got This Day in History, which we do every week uh, here on 
office hours. Uh, as far as this weekend, we've got some of our UTRGV athletics teams that are in action. Uh, tomorrow, women's volleyball playing at Houston Christian. We've got women's soccer coming to town on Sunday the 6th with uh, um, Stephen F. Austin coming to town uh, playing women's soccer team. Uh, also, later on on the 6th on Sunday, uh, men's soccer uh, is playing also uh, here, in, well, in Edinburgh. Uh, they're playing Grand Canyon University. And then on Tuesday, women's volleyball takes on our rivals up at Texas A&M Corpus Christi. The Islanders up there uh, are coming down to play the volleyball team. So make sure you get out there and uh, support our UTRGV athletics student athletes. Uh, they work so hard. Um, it's you know it's hard enough being a student, and uh, uh, they're also athletes that take up a lot, quite a bit of their time. So uh, make sure you get out there. Remember, all, all students get in free. Uh, to all of our UTRGV athletic events. So if you're looking for something to do, um, check out uh, our UTRGV athletics teams uh, whenever you can. Uh, let's get back to the music. Uh, I've got a little bit of uh, talking heads here. Uh, this one's called Burning Down the House. Boy, this is a fun song. Um, been around for, wow, this is in, in the 80s, I guess, you know. So check out this talking heads. You know you love it. Turn it up wherever you are. Listen to what get away. Sonic Youth. Only on Vaquero Radio, the Valley's student station. That's a song called Teenage Riot. It's probably their first uh, mainstream success, uh, getting a little bit of uh, radio play uh, from the from the record Daydream Nation. Uh, Sonic Youth. Uh, only on Vaquero Radio. Before that, you heard "Burning Down the House" by the Talking Heads. Um. Still doing it. Um, David Byrne had his, gosh, what, American Utopia, I think it was called, uh, HBO special. Really fun. Included lots of uh, Talking Heads music and performance art and you know on the stage and stuff. I uh, certainly recommend it if you haven't seen it yet. Uh, make sure you uh, check that out. Uh, college Radio Day today. Hopefully you're going to stop by here in Brownsville. Uh, we're set up and playing tunes outside the Union. Uh, come pick up a snack. We've got some bag chips. We've got some water uh, in there. You can interact with our staff, uh, learn more about it. We'll show you how to use the Radio Garden app, too. Uh, if you haven't downloaded it yet, check out your app store, whichever phone you have, Android or Apple. Um, go uh, Search for Radio Garden. Uh, as in flower garden, right? Radio garden. Uh, and it's not a, you can not only hear Vaquero Radio uh, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 days a year, but uh, you can check out radio stations from all over the world, uh, the globe. Uh, when you first, it looks like a Google Earth map, if you've ever seen one of those, when you first sign in. Uh, it'll use your location and give you radio stations near your zip code or wherever you're at right now. But uh, if you want to listen to Vaquero Radio, just search for Vaquero Radio. Uh, you'll be able to pick us up. Uh, also, if you search in Edinburgh, Edinburgh, Texas, uh, just like Edinburgh, Scotland, but without the H at the end, uh, uh, you'll be able to listen to Vaquero Radio wherever you are, at the beach, uh, on the bus, um, in the car, wherever you are, uh, listen to Vaquero Radio. Uh, connect up with the Bluetooth. Uh, listen to us in the gym. Uh, don't listen to us during class, of course. Make sure you're paying attention <laughs> in class. So, yeah, we're about six weeks into the semester already. Hopefully things are going well for you. And uh, as we do every week, I've got uh, This Day in History. Today is October 4th. And on this day in 2011, a man who served 25 years for murder is finally exonerated by DNA evidence. On October 4th, 2011, Michael Morton, who spent 25 years in prison for his wife's murder, is released after DNA evidence implicates another man in the crime. The prosecutor in the case later was accused of withholding evidence, indicating that Morton was innocent. On the afternoon of August 13th, 1986, a neighbor found 31-year-old Christine Morton beaten to death in her bed in the Williamson County, Texas home, which is near Austin. She shared with Michael, uh, a grocery store manager, and their three-year-old son. Six weeks later, Morton, who had no criminal record or history of violence, was arrested for Christine's murder. 
At trial, the prosecution contended Morton had slain his wife of seven years after she refused to have sex with him on the night of August 12th, his 32nd birthday. Morton maintained he had nothing to do with his wife's death and said an intruder must have killed her after he left for work early in the morning of August 13th. No witnesses or physical evidence linked Morton to the crime. Nevertheless, he was convicted on February 17, 1987, and sentenced to life behind bars. In 2005, Morton's defense team asked the state to test DNA on a variety of items, including a blood-stained bandana found by police the day after the murder at an abandoned construction site close to the Morton home. The Williamson County District Attorney successfully blocked all requests for testing until 2010, when a Texas appeals court ordered that testing on the bandana take place. In the summer of 2011, the test results revealed the bandana contained Christine Morton's blood and hair, along with the DNA of another man, Mark Allen Norwood, a felon with a long criminal record who worked in the Austin area as a carpet layer at the time of the murder. Michael Morton was released from prison on October 4, 2011, and officially exonerated in December of that year. A month after Morton was freed, Norwood, 57, was arrested for Christine Morton's killing. In March 2013, he was found guilty of her murder and sentenced to life in prison. Based on DNA evidence, Norwood was also indicted for killing a second woman, Deborah Baker, whose 1988 murder in Austin had remained unsolved. Like Morton, Baker was bludgeoned to death in her bed. She lived just blocks away from Norwood at the time of her murder. Uh, Also on this day in history, back in 1955, the Brooklyn Dodgers win their first World Series. In 1927, work begins on Mount Rushmore, uh, which would be unveiled uh, during uh, FDR's presidency. In 1957, the first satellite uh, to be launched into Earth orbit, Sputnik, was launched. And also, in 1970, Janis Joplin dies of a heroin overdose. Uh, In 1990, Beverly Hills 90210 debuts on television. And finally, in 1988, televangelist Jim Baker is indicted on federal charges of mail and wire fraud and of conspiring to defraud the public. The case against the founder of Praise the Lord Ministries and three of his aides exploded in the press when it was revealed that Baker had sex with former church secretary Jessica Hahn. Uh, He's still a televangelist. He's out of prison um, and uh, still um, plying his trade on, uh, you know, multiple media outlets. So uh, Jim Baker still doing it. (laughs) All right. Let's get a little bit of Fugazi in here. Can't go wrong with Fugazi. He's friends with Bumbazzi. You remember him, right? Only on Vaquero Radio, the Valley's student station. (laughs) <laughs> That's a public enemy with Fight the Power, only on Vaquero Radio, the Valley's student station. Thanks for tuning in this morning. We're really excited about College Radio Day today. But uh, let's uh, first, you you heard that that was Fight the Power, public enemy. Before that, Cigarettes After Sex with uh, Nothing's Gonna Hurt You, Baby. And we started it off with Fugazi, who hangs out with Boombazi. It's with Waiting Room from the 13 Songs LP. Uh, only on Vaquero Radio, the Valley Student Station. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, as we do, it's 83 degrees here in Brownsville, beautiful Brownsville. Sunny skies, uh, possibility for some rain today, but we've don't worry, we've got a tent up uh, protecting our equipment here for College Radio Day. Make sure you stop by the Student Union in Brownsville. Say hi to the staff, pick up some snacks, um, and we'll show you how to use the Radio Garden app and get it on your phone so you can listen to Vaquero Radio or... Any radio station across. I was showing the uh, some students. Uh, what was I showing students or someone else yesterday? My first exposure to college radio, WSOU uh, from Seton Hall University, South Orange, New Jersey. I could pick it up on clear nights from Queens, New York, across the water, but uh, still on, and it's on Radio Garden too. So I'm loving that, uh, as well as some of the other stations I've mentioned on co- on uh, office hours. 89.3 The Current, that public radio station up in Minneapolis, and KCRW in Los Angeles, another public radio station that does uh, in, in-studio in performances and uh, is has some great, great uh, tunes that they play. As we do every week on Office Hours, I've got a great poem for you. Uh, this one from Leonard Cohen. Uh, it's based uh, on, uh, for, on, on a poem called For Those Who Greeted Me. 
Um, and uh, Leonard Cohen put it into put it to music, and it's on his 10 New Songs LP. But we're going to just uh, recite the verse today. This is a poem called For Those Who Greeted Me. You came to me this morning and you handled me like meat. You'd have to live, you'd have to live alone to know how good that feels, how sweet. My mirror twin, my next of kin, I'd know you in my sleep. And who but you would take me in a thousand kisses deep. I loved you when you opened like a lily to the heat. I'm just another snowman standing in the rain and sleet who loved you with his frozen love, his second-hand physique, with all he is and all he was, a thousand kisses deep. I know you had to lie to me. I know you had to cheat. But the means no longer guarantee the virtue in deceit. That truth is bent, that beauty spent, that style is obsolete. Ever since the Holy Spirit went a thousand kisses deep. I'm turning tricks, I'm getting fixed, I'm back on Boogie Street. I tried to quit the business, hey, I'm lazy and I'm weak. But sometimes when the night is slow, the wretched and the meek, we gather up our hearts and go a thousand kisses deep. And I'm still working with the wine, still dancing cheek to cheek. The bland is playing Auld Lang Syne, the heart will not retreat. And maybe I had miles to drive and promises to keep. You dish it, ditch it all to stay alive, a thousand kisses deep. And now you are the angel death, and now the paraclete. And now you are the savior's breath, and now the belson heap. No turning from the thread of love, no transcendental leap. As witnessed here in time and blood, a thousand kisses deep. That's a poem titled, For Those Who Greeted Me, uh, and also um, connected to a Leonard Cohen singing an early version of A Thousand Kisses Deep. Only on Vaquero Radio, we do... We, 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 we elevate uh, your, your, your tastes uh, by giving you uh, poems. <laughs> so, thanks for tuning in, Vaqueros. This is DJ Doc V. Got one song left for you. We're going to leave you with a little brandy here on Vaquero Radio, the Valley's student station. Make sure you're ready for the weekend. Be prepared. Maybe a little rain in the Valley this weekend, so be prepared. We'll see you at College Radio Day today. I am DJ Doc V. We'll see you next week on Office Hours. And for now, enjoy some brandy. Only on Vaquero Radio, the Valley's student station.